As you may know, Dodge has recently sent me a letter that's not so friendly. Basically, they want to sue me. And I'm making this video to first say, you know, I apologize to your Dodge. Like, I really don't want any of the smoke. After reading over the letter a few times or so, it pretty much just said that y'all don't like that people are believing that the Hellcord is a Dodge vehicle. And specifically, the Dodge Hellcat Accord, which is not even the badge on the car. Because as you can see, this says SRT Hellcord. That may be a Dodge badge. But why would you sell this if you're not, if you don't want me to use it? Like, why would this be somewhere on the internet where I can buy? on Amazon if you didn't want me to use it. And this is from you. This is not like from some random who made This is an OEM Dodge bat. Dodge still may sue me after this, but this is my last attempt to not get fully sued. So let's make some clarifications for everyone who is confused. This vehicle right here is a Hellcourt. This is not Hellcat or Court or anything affiliated with Dodge. All this badge and everything like that was born by me after the fact that I bought the vehicle. This is actually a Honda. As you can see, just look at this car. Does this look like a Dodge? to you if it does it's not it's a honda stop thinking that probably also heard that this srt red key is actually to this vehicle which make make you believe that this is a dodge vehicle but actually that's all cap this is actually just a random key shell that i bought online i taped the picture of the srt in the back because it even come with the srt badge and it does actually work there's no actual like electronics inside here it's just for jokes i mean i thought it was kind of clear especially back in one of the videos when i actually specifically specified that this key is a joke you can't tell already this red key unfortunately does it actually work for the car dodge you want to show that in court i mean i got the receipts all right just in case if it actually goes all the way to court i mean as you can see i'm wearing the pop the hood merch from chasingmotoshop.com if you go to the link in the description down below you can buy this exact shirt that i'm wearing right now with the menacing hell cord and it says pop the hood if you don't want to pop the hood that's cool because we got one that looks exactly the same but instead of saying pop the hood it says hell cord and a couple of designs so go check out and help me because i may actually need a lot of money for a legal team now another thing I want to bring to attention of Dodge and pretend to the core, this is a Hama badge. If this was a Dodge view, a true OEM stock Dodge car, why would it have a Honda badge? Why would it look exactly the same as a 2004 Honda Accord? but with slightly modifications to it because that's what it is it's a 2004 i mean we don't gotta talk about the engine the engine is heavily modified because it's not even the same engine the body like the outside of the car it looks like a honda accord and if you still want to be aware about me having a real hellcat engine under the car which makes some believe is a dodge vehicle that doesn't make any sense because people do hellcat swaps all the time and i'm pretty sure y'all sell cray engines like what the fuck you think people gonna do with that they're gonna go put that in a different car with also Right here let's take a gander on the front there's another honda badge <laughs> like i don't see a single dodge badge besides the hellcat badges but that's the hellcat badges to you know make it the true hell cord because of the engine i'm not putting anything that says dodge on this car or anything that generally makes it believable that this was made by dodge like you're really gonna look at this car look at all these much look at the scratch mark the hood scoop the hellcat badge on the side and you're gonna say that it's a dodge vehicle it's blasphemy and I don't want to hear this bullshit anymore. Actually, I shouldn't say I want to be for real Dodge. Like, I'm sorry. Like, don't sue me. It's not a Dodge car. I'm trying to clear up to everyone. This video hopefully will get these amount my views. So Dodge will think that the message really has gotten out there. That the Hellcord is not a Dodge vehicle. It's actually a Honda that was just very heavily modified. Now, for some reason, you still don't really know what's going on. And you haven't seen the first video talking about this lawsuit in the letter. Well, the video is on screen right now. So all you got to do is click and go watch it. 